So have you ever heard of the NUC, the next level of computing? This is Intel's version of a small form factor PC, missing a couple of components, but customizable and still pretty powerful. And today, we're going to take a look at the latest iteration. It's time for Unbox Daily. Welcome to Unbox Daily, I'm your host Jason. And today we're gonna to take a look at the Hades Canyon NUC, Intel's latest addition to their NUC line, which sports a smaller form factor, but a phenomenal set of power given the price and size. If you like what you see and you wanna check out more, hit that subscribe button. And if you really love us, hit that bell as well. So let's take a look at the Hades NUC. Now, this is a small form factor PC, about the size, say, of half of a laptop, and it comes without an operating system memory or storage. So you're gonna have to buy those in addition to the system. But what you get is a pretty powerful, very tiny PC experience that's pretty flexible for most gaming needs. Let's take a look at the specs as well as some of the ports available for the various kinds of setups you might like with Dave2D. Now this is a bare bones unit, so it doesn't come with RAM, storage, or even an operating system. You have to pop it open and put it in yourself. There's two NVMe drive slots and two RAM slots. You can pack up to 32 gigs of RAM, and it's actually really easy to build into the system. Like very few screws you have to deal with. And every time I open one of these things up, it surprises me as to how they can fit everything, everything into something so small while still retaining all of the functionality. So this thing actually has a crazy number of ports. There's two Thunderbolt 3s, a bunch of USB A's. This is completely riddled with ports. So as you can see from the internals, there's a decent amount of flexibility in terms of what kind of storage and RAM you can insert here based on your individual gaming needs. And hey, if you look at the number of ports on the back of that thing, you can pretty much set it up with whatever display and inputs you want, and you'll be pretty much guaranteed to get exactly the experience you're looking for. Now, the really cool thing here is the fact that you've got an Intel chip with an AMD GPU on exactly the same form factor. You don't see that very often, particularly not in a system of this size. And I gotta tell you, it is sending everybody up the wall with excitement about how cool this thing is. For example, here's Linus from Linus Tech Tips absolutely fanboying over this little chipset. Yes, my friends, AMD's custom silicon solution department, the same guys that have worked with the game console makers, are actually providing a GPU to Intel, and this is an HBM2 memory module. So all three of these are sitting on this really special special layer that I can't actually even show you guys because it's so small, but it's called an EMIB and it allows high speed communication between all three of these components. So effectively, this is a full PCI Express 8x Gen 3 link between the CPU and the GPU. I think the last time I got that excited about something, I was being given my first Game Boy when I was six or seven years old. The fact that he's that stoked about this thing means that that's probably a pretty special little chipset. So if you're if you weren't interested before, I, I hope you're interested now. So as we've said, this is a fairly simple system to upgrade and manage depending on your various needs. And more specifically for the gaming crowd, you're not gonna get top level performance out of this, but you're still gonna get a solid set of hardware for any number of different needs. As shown here by the folks at Simply Nook, who wanted to show off exactly the kind of RAM that you could get for a gaming experience that'll match up to most expectations. All right, starting from the right, we have the two DDR4 uh, 2400 dim sockets, and this can support uh, 2400 or 2133 at a lower latency. The performance is about the same. And if you order 32 gig of RAM, you get a gaming uh, memory. Uh, so this is actually low latency gaming RAM DIMMs. And that comes standard with the 32 gig memory option. These are getting hard to come by now. Now, the one thing that they didn't mention in that segment, this setup not only allows you to do most gaming at relatively high performance value, but you can also use it for VR and mixed reality. So, I mean, again, you're getting a pretty decent experience out of the box for relatively low investment. But you don't have to believe me straight up about this VR mixed reality experience. In fact, you could probably, if you can imagine it, take the system, make it portable, and use a mixed reality setup to play a game without physical limitation. In fact, that's what Austin Evans got to do, where he was shown a demo where he got to use this system attached to the back of a leather jacket and was able to play a mixed reality game completely freeform. So what's really cool about the setup is that because the NUC is going to be so small that we can actually really run it easily on a battery, and it allows me to be completely and totally untethered. I'm gonna... I'm gonna grab your gun, grab your gun, shoot you, throw the knife. Oh, okay, I just got shot. All right, all right, all right, I can, I can do this, I can do this. The main idea here is that because not only am I untethered with the PC and the battery, but I'm also using the mixed reality headset, so I actually don't need any sort of sensors around me. I can kind of freely walk around. It feels pretty good. This is really cool. 
Now granted, it might be a little bit too much of a homebrew setup, but you have to admit, there's some really interesting possibilities with this system if you wanted to go and take it a step above and beyond. And that's it for this very quick look at the Hades Canyon Nuck. What do you think? Worth buying or maybe save your money? Either way, if you like what you see and you want to check out more, head on over to Unbox.tv or look us up on the iOS store. In the meantime, I'll be back here soon with more great videos from your favorite product reviewers and unboxers. I'm your host, Jason. Have a great day.